many colleges and universities have uh, theology departments or religion departments. At Dallas Baptist University, uh, such a department is called the College of Christian Faith. More specifically, uh, the Mary C. Crowley College of Christian Faith. I had the privilege of getting to know the late Mary Crowley when I was on the staff of the First Baptist Church in Dallas. In fact, I'm here in a conference room. Uh, you can see her name, Mary C. Crowley. College of Christian Faith, uh, there is her picture of the late Mary Crowley. As the story was told to me, uh, there was a staff member there at First Baptist Dallas, a single lady. Uh, Mary was divorced with two kids and they would look in their purses pool their money to see where they could afford to go eat lunch on Sunday. Uh, Mary had a dream, and she pursued that dream. She wanted to help people beautify their homes, and her dream was home interiors and gifts. Uh, finally, uh, she was able to get a loan to get her business started, and she became very, very successful. In fact, her son, uh, Don Carter, uh, was the owner of the Dallas Mavericks uh, prior to Mark Cuban. Uh, Mary loved the Lord Jesus Christ. She loved her church, taught Sunday school every Sunday, um, and she supported Christian and kingdom causes. Uh, two great lessons to learn from the wonderful life of Mary Crowley. One is this, pursue your dream. Uh, pursue your dream. Uh, the second is leave a legacy. Leave a le legacy. Uh, she was an extremely, extremely uh, generous woman, endowing and giving and blessing so many as a result of her biblical stewardship. So let me encourage you uh, to be inspired by a life of the late Mary Crowley. And let me say, be inspired and act accordingly. God bless you. Have a good evening.